Don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon. Like our videos. When you are divided, you try to think, I'm better than you. I'm a local, you are a foreigner. What is this? A Muslim don't talk that I'm a local, I'm a foreigner. A Muslim talk about one ummah. Everybody said, La ilaha illallah Muhammad Rasul. They are our brothers. They are our sisters. We are no more strangers. The Prophet said, What do you hear when you say the Prophet's name been mentioned? What do you do? Sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Man da'a ila asabiyya. Wa qatala ala asabiyya. Fahmat. Fahmaitahu maitatan jahidiyya. Whoever called to nationalism. Talking about national, my national, my race. And they fight at the banner of race. If they die, the Prophet said, they will not die as a believer. They will die like a jahiliya, like a pagan. That is the spirit of the pagan. I'm better than you because I'm white. You are black. I'm better than you because I'm an Arab and you are non-Arab. I'm better than you because I'm a Malaysian, I'm a local and you are not local. Who gives you the right to do that? Who taught us to do that? Who gives you that spirit? That idea is the shaitan. The moment you say you are better, that is what he has said to God. Anna khairu min hu. Oh Allah, I'm better than Adam. Who say that? Shaitan. Anybody feel I'm better than another one because of color, because of race? You know who is there. We don't let this happen. We are here to change. And you have two more days with us. There is Friday, a great day. A very important day to make changes, to behave. And this is very important. We do a lot of outdoor activities. While we are doing activities, we are monitoring your behavior without you realize. We are looking at what you are doing. Are you learning? Are you following instruction? Are you working as a team? Are you helping your fellow brother, your fellow sisters? Among the sisters, all this is recorded. And we believe that you can do, you can change, you can be strong, you can be better. Wherever you go, all the boys and the girls, you must know the Satan is everywhere. He stay in this world before us. He live in this place. Before there is no Langkawi, do you know where is Langkawi? This Langkawi Island, for seven generations, no development. Meaning 700 years, this island was deserted. Why? It's because of something happened in this island. There was a very pious lady with the family. Somebody created fitna and said that she commit adultery. So they torture her to death. He said, I'm innocent. But they create this fitna because she's a very pretty lady. Sometimes you are so good People don't like you. The evil eye come after you. She make a prayer because she's been wrong. 
He said, if I'm right, may Allah be the judge. And may Allah make Langkawi Island seven generation Langkawi have no development, no fruits grow here. Everything is like Padang, the Kuko Padang Ma'ashirat. You remember the name? And it's proven that he was, she was true. She was been oppressed. And the prayer of the Muslim will not be rejected by Allah. Then development, development came in. This area, when there's no blessing of Allah, then is the island of the Adel Force. The island of what? The jinn. Then development came in. There's no problem. There was no building here before. Now there's a building. We, we all came to their area. They have no problem. But you must behave. You must remember Allah. How many of you, boy, I want you to tell me the truth, nothing but the truth and the whole truth. You understand that? You go to the court, that's what they will tell you. You only speak the truth, nothing but the truth and the whole truth, not half truth. So that Allah will help you and forgive you. How many of you recite dua before you go to bed? Bismillahumma amuntu wa Raise up your hand. Those who only recite. Those who don't recite, don't raise up your hand. Good. How many of you, down your hand, how many of you recite Ayatul Kursi? Good. How many of you recite the three Kul? Kul Huwallah, Kul Anufala, Kul Abdinnas. Good. These are the things that the Prophet said, don't forget Allah. You need Allah's protection. And the protection of Allah will come to you when you connect yourself with Allah. But we are too busy thinking of so many things that do not benefit you. Talking about so many things that do not benefit you too. But you think we are good. We thought that we are smart to do that. No, you are not smart. You still allow your enemy to control you. Your enemy wants you to think of him. You don't want to think of him. You think of Allah. That's how you overcome your enemy. I'm not going to think of you. There are so many good things for me to think. I better focus on the good thing, the good energy. Why must I focus on the bad thing? What do you gain by thinking of the negative? You don't gain anything. You become negative. Think of the positive and move on. You know that we don't have many days with you left. Tonight, tomorrow night, and then the third night, you're on the way, on the way home. But before you leave, we want to make sure that you become better. You have to improve yourself, boys. Even God, who has all the power of Allah to change you, He said to you, Inna Allah la yughayr ma biqawm. Allah will not change your condition until you decide to change. So you have to make the decision. Do you want to change, boy? Do you want to change, boy? 
Girls, do you want to change? Alhamdulillah. You know, when we are overseas, especially with the rivers in America, when we ask them if there are 500 of them in the hall, 1,000 of them in the hall, do you want to change? You know, the whole hall tremble. You hear the sound, the united sound. Yes, that's what they say. Yes, no, yeah, yeah. There is a spirit when the people ask you, Do you want to change? What do you say? Yes. You say, Yes, no more thinking, huh? What to change, huh? You just have to say yes first. You learn how to express. You learn how to say yes. What do you say? Yes. Yeah, there is a spirit. That spirit will help you, wake you up. Who do you fear more? Allah. That is why you always, we always say, Allah, I fear you more. When you fear Allah more, the other thing go. I have shared with you maybe. Earlier, I do not know. When people say here have all this, our enemy around the jinn, I will go. It's not that I want to challenge them, no. I'm not here to tell them that I want to fight with you, no. I have to fight within myself. I know that Allah said to me that He has no power. And He said to Allah, He cannot do anything to you if Allah do not allow. Only be izzatillah. With the permission of Allah, He can come and disturb you. He also acknowledged that He is helpless, powerless, because all the power belongs to Allah. La hawla wa la quwwata illa billah. Hasbi Allah wa ni'ma wakil. So beautiful ayah, so many beautiful ayah. You just have to connect yourself with Allah. Call upon Allah. Then you know that other force will have to leave you. You understand, boys? Girls, do you understand that? Alhamdulillah. The girl's voice is louder than the boy or the boy. You have how many boys here? Hundred, it double, almost double yeah, the size of the girls. Do you understand, boy? Yes. yes, that's how you want to say. Yes. You have to wake yourself up. Yes. No, yeah. You know, like the battery, you have some problem. You have to recharge your battery. Good. Now, do we fear Allah more? Yes. yes. You have to say it to yourself so that that other friend of you, your enemy, know. But I'm not going to say, no, I want to fight with you. No need, you cannot fight. You just fight within yourself. We don't want to be arrogant. I'm strong. You are not strong until you can control yourself. When you have discipline in prayer, when you are focused in your prayer, and in remembering Allah, and in reciting the Quran, Alhamdulillah, you are ready for anything. In the near future, you know, we have been organizing this camp since the 80s, before you all was born. From the 80s, we have organized this camp. And there are times that we bring all our participants to sleep in the cave. By 10 p.m., we'll leave all the room or the accommodation that we live at night, we walk 
up to the cave. And to go up to the cave, there is a swinging ladder. It's not a concrete ladder. And then, of course, we have to go into the cave before all of you. To ask Allah, to ask the caretaker of the cave, to bring peace to all of us. We make prayer. And that cave, when you enter at night, you don't see anything. It's like you're in a total darkness. And the way we organize for the children is not to sleep side by side. No. We spread out every one of you. That's how we train our children to be strong. Alhamdulillah. Because we ask Allah to protect us. Everybody who went into the cave and they sleep very, very well. They have a very good sleep. We just said, you just think of Allah. Close your eye. If you open your eyes so you can't see anything, it's better to close your eye and make zikir. La ilaha illallah. Ayatul Kursi, the three kujas, recite. Whatever ayat you memorize, recite. Alhamdulillah, it was so beautiful, so quiet, because we don't allow anybody to talk, a complete silence. Then you feel the peace, Allahu Akbar, like you are in a different world. Fajar came in, Allahu Akbar. You feel the breeze, the morning breeze. Then we go for hunting. We go deeper to the cave to look for the vet, the vet nest. Hundred thousand of vets is hanging in that cave. But you don't go at night. And one beautiful that in the cave, no mosquito, no other insect, because when there is bats, bat will come after them. And at night, you know, the bat can see. They have the ultra. They have what? Yeah, night vision. But they don't disturb you. Because you don't disturb them. Alhamdulillah. You know what we have planned for you all tonight? Somebody is resting, it's okay for them who rest because they are tired. We normally have an exercise for a night walk. To bring you in. Where? We don't know. But someone knows. But I've discussed with all our team to cancel that activities. There is a night walk. There are times that we will walk in between the between the what? In the forest, between the water. Because there's a river. But Alhamdulillah, you don't have to worry. You have other activities. It's been replaced with other activities. We just want all the boys and the girls, remember you have two more days with us. I want all of you to maximize yeah, your company with us. We have all the scholars beside you, the elders, who can help you to overcome whatever problem that you encounter. You just have to be strong. You just have to be positive. And if you experience anything that is very normal, 
is not abnormal, it's normal. But because you are weak, then you feel yeah, some problem. So you have to help each other, be strong, be united, remember Allah. And there will be a lot of fascists with you. When you are asleep, boys and girls, do you think most of us are asleep? No. We wake up until very, very late in the morning. 12 o'clock, 1 o'clock, 2 o'clock, 3 o'clock. We are still awake. Some of them are still awake. So you must not feel that you are alone. No. Allah is there to protect you. All the fascists, the uncle, yeah, the big brother is there to protect you. Now you just have to be connected to Allah. Don't forget ayat to proceed. Don't forget the three cool. Every ayat that you remember, if you remember Surah Al-Baqarah, just recite, just recite, just think of Allah, just think of Allah, you become stronger and stronger and stronger because Allah said, Faskuruni azkurukum, whoever call upon me, remember me, I will remember them. When I remember them, and I will protect them. When I protect them, I will call angel Gabriel to protect them. And Gabriel will call all the other angels, the good energy, the good force, to protect all of us. And nobody can cause harm to you anymore. But if you don't get any protection from Allah, even the window can cause unrest to you. Even the wind can cause unrest in you. Suddenly the wind blow, and the window start to move. Or the door start to give some sound. Kalas. Now you have problem. I hear the window. I hear the sound here. I hear the door. Yes, it's door. Sound is everywhere. Because you are protected by Allah, they can have this sound, the wind can come from this direction, the door can slam, I want to sleep. Bismillahumma amutu wa ahya Allahu la ilaha illa I want to sleep. You will sleep. You will sleep. Do you think this one is worse than your smartphone? No. Your smartphone is worse. He control your mind, he control your body, he control everything. This one is just, he want to make friend. They just want to you know, have some new friend. You just be together. Remember Allah. Everything so, because when Allah protection is there for you. You understand it, boys? Yes. You understand this, boys? Yes. Sisters, do you understand that? Yes. Alhamdulillah. Uh, now there's a brother trying to say something else. May Allah Rabbul Alameen protect all of us. May Allah give us the energy, the strength to fight the enemy within ourselves. May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala strengthen our connection with Allah Rabbul Alameen and make us always remember Him. Min al-zakirin wa zakirat Min al-qanitin wa al-qanitat Min al-shakirin wa shakirat Min al-sabirin wa sabirat Min al-sadiqin wa sadiqat May Allah make us among the righteous people The one who Allah said is right He will say right Who is truthful The one who has patience The one who is consistent Consistently remember Allah Rabbul Alameen yeah, And the one who Protect themselves With the protection of Allah so that Allah will protect all of you. And may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala 
make you a different person after this camp. Amen. Any question from the boys? Any question at all? Alhamdulillah. Girls, any question? Remember, yeah, remember, we are all at one ummah, one family, here to help each other. Yeah. Alhamdulillah, what is the program after this? Yeah? Night sketch. We have a program to, yeah, to continue. And where is the, all the other facets? Do you need the facets? Yeah, the side. Eh? Yeah, all the facets is having a, a urgent meeting. Yeah. And we want all the boys to be strong and all the sisters to be strong. Be united, you will be strong. Remember Allah, you will be strong. And may Allah Rabbul Alameen yeah, strengthen the relationship between us that we do not just remember one another just here for five nights, six days but we will have yeah, the connection until we grow big one day. Maybe you become a billionaire, you become a trillionaire, you become a minister. Maybe one of you become one of the ministers. Nothing is impossible. Yeah? You become a scientist, you become a specialist in this and that, and we are connected with one another. Just don't forget us when you become somebody. Yeah? Especially your parents. Don't look down upon them. Don't belittle them. You always try to give the best and Allah will give you the best. Yeah? Always try to give the best, Allah will give you the best. Alhamdulillah. Yeah. Two more minutes. Yeah. Alhamdulillah. What can you do in two minutes? Yeah. The brother gave you a very good advice. Say, Zikrullah. Ya Zikrullah You remember what I said to all of you When you are down When your spirit is down When you are weak What do you say? La ilaha illallah Say what? La ilaha illallah When you are weak and down Just say that When you are overconfident You are proud of yourself Astaghfirullah Astaghfirullah Ask Allah for forgiveness Because that wrong energy is coming in. The negative feeling is coming in. But when you are down, you know, in the time of the companions of the prophets, when they are little in number, small in number, and the enemy is big in number, how to charge their battery? By saying, we are doing for Allah. La ilaha illallah. Everything for Allah. Now recite this ayat with me. Kul. In the salati, wa nusuki, wa mahyaya, wa mamati, lillahi rabbil alamin. Alhamdulillah. This is what we say to Allah. Oh Allah, say to yourself, all my prayer, all my sacrifices, my living what I do in this life, and my dying is only for you, oh Allah. Only for you. You fulfill this promise with Allah. Allah fulfills His promise with you. May Allah help you. And may Allah give you a good ending, inshallah. And good night. Subhanakallahumma bi'amdik. Ashadu an la ilaha illa anta. Astaghfiruka. Wa atubu ilayhi. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.